Tony got that base secrets and files and lose more of these friends. Welcome back to more. The Jim Zella, Twilight Prince, the last episode. We made it back to Fall Wood. Got through the sick. Got into the sick girl. Fox Skull Kid again. Got the last golden. Got the last golden insect. Got the giant wall and entered back in time to the Temple of Time. So who can run up these new found stair stairs of light? Go up to this window. And now we're gonna stop by the Temple of Time. I love the music in this area, and I also love this dungeon. Although it has eight floors, today one sitting of this dungeon is gonna be played today. Oh boy, this is gonna be annoying. I love the way this dungeon looks. Bell and Center will be for later. Anyway. No, then let's go right up to this door. For that was weird. Did you see that? The camera bugged out there for a second. You're right. In a grove and in a temple, there's always two statues right next to each other. Hmm. There was the other one. If there was another one. Actually, let's check for them. Hey, Mendel's right. There's one missing. Alright, no statue somewhere in this dungeon. Just to say, it's on the top floor. So this will take a while. Especially getting it back down here. Plus, I have no idea how to move it. So take this um, kind of statue thingy. Statue thingy. Put it on this thing to raise up a platform. And you want to have your lantern out. Not the boomerang lantern, because. You have to get a small key in this area first, but you have to light two torches on the other side of this smiley face, because it's possible looks like a face. Uka's right over there. I don't want to talk to you just yet. I love this dungeon. It is probably one of the few dungeons in this game that I remember ev where every collectible is at the top of my head. The music, the music's good. Potential temple layout is okay, in my opinion. Let's open this and get the small, first small key of this dungeon. If I remember, there's a third, two small keys? Or is this the only one I forget? Let's just go up this and talk to Uku, who is not a part of time. Uh, not so fast. At last, this is it. This is what I've been trying to get to. You've been trying to go back in time for a long time, but you kept getting caught in, but you kept getting trapped in pause. And if you can't see it from the way the screen, from the light, shine off, the Bird that's flying right next to Uku's head is basically Uku's son, which can only you can only get that thing is if you use Uku to enter exit the dungeon. The ancient technology of our people sleeps in this place. Wait, you mean there's something from Skyward Sword here? Nice. You can smell it. Okay. So with this thing, you can finally go back home. Question! How do you smell it? If it's all the way, if the thing that you look for is all the way on the top floor, yes, on the top floor, and at least she was, they was glitched to the platform. I'm just there, not that, huh? Anyway, new enemy! Guess what this enemy's called? It's called a GOMA! Today, I'm very, I'm very excitable. These things die from two slash foot and sword, and um, another one of those things. <laughs> Alright. Very easy, uh, puzzle. You want to put this on here. Go on that path. Each path. Um, this contains, I think, group is. Okay, arrows. Kill this Goma. Now, for oh, now the arrows come in handy because you need to. Whoops, I got the wrong thing. Group. You need to shoot the pod way on the other side of this gate. There you go. No, you you press forward. Why don't you take out my sword? Where's the foot? How's it going, buddies? Wow, he glitched. 
Um, more of the foot sweetness. Oh, there's three of them. Wow. And I hear keys. Oh! Hey, buddy, how's it going? That's key. Anyway, new enemy. Almost. Want to get behind him and slash this crystal behind him. You can't use bombs. Okay, now right here is the dungeon map. Here is the map. Alright. Now we got lots more of this dungeon. As you can see, most of the dungeon's center rooms are circular. Let's go up here and open up this chip, I think it takes money, or bombs. It's money! You want to grab... You want to grab a key. That's what I was about to say. You want to grab these statues and put them over here on these, um, switches. Okay, so, uh, you. Let's roll. I really cannot wait for the pu for more puzzles to get into this when we get to more puzzles because I love the puzzles in this place. Let's continue going. Ignore the keys. Now we're in this room. This I can somewhat say is somewhat your center the main hub of the dungeon. Somewhat. Oh yeah, this is a different version of the Beamos. Um, I'll be right back in. I'll be right back. I need to check something. Cool. Um, if I'm gonna, do, if the screen looks different, that's because a random little foot came out of nowhere. It's gonna shit on me. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea where you come from. But thanks for the good jump scare today. When you get closer, the beam will act. Beam will activate. As you shoot it to kill it. Damn it! I actually do know where that was came from, but I wasn't paying that close attention. He came from over this direction. Oh, what's the bottom of lizard foot? I swear to God, this is a lizard party. Um, okay, dude. Postal! Can't get it yet! Even if you try getting closer, it won't come to you. God! I just remember a lot of lizard foot that I don't remember. That I seriously don't remember. Those are the means I'll get into later. Seriously, look at all the lizard foot! That was like. Let's see now. That's six lizard foot in this one room! And wow, they actually blocked me those tight. OW! How they're tiny shields, and I cannot talk today. Thanks a for hitting me in the face for your tail. Um. Oh, great spinner again. I've got this temple has you using the spinner a couple, a little bit. Get off. All right, now we're in this area. Uh, no, go have a small key. You want to? Where am I going? Um. You want to... I don't know how to do this, this spot. Um, watch out for those things. These things are getting annoying. Oh yeah, now I remember. want to pick up this guy. This guy! Bring him over here and set him on this switch. Um, you need another one. Oh god, if I would have found... Of course that happens. If I would have felt that, that would have been... EXCUSE ME! Oh, down there. Uh, okay, now I want to turn this thing counterclockwise. I think this is it. Make sure you go down. No, it makes you go up the wrong way! You want to put it to clockwise! Push. 
All right, now come in here now. New enemy. Say hello to the Goma Larva. These things die with one hit to the s with a sword. These things are weak, but they get annoying if there's a lot of, if there's a whole swarm of them. So be careful that if you get in between a lot of them, they're gonna come right at you. But they mostly just like to run away from you. But they. If I remember these things do a uh, quarter part of damage. These things usually drop a lot of hearts or a lot of arrows. You can kill them with the arrows. Which you yep, actually nah. If you kill all of them that electric gate that blocks this room. Like right there. Will open itself. And I wanna really drop my arrows. Just because I want to shoot them. There you go. I just finished doing the last two. Alright. Now I want to pick up this guy. I just want to kill those guys. You don't have to kill them. Uh, now we got to turn this thing counterclockwise. Going the wrong way, me. Alright. Now I got to grab the statue. And watch out for those things. There you go. Ah! Uh, no fair. Oh wait. Okay, that's double no fair. Crap. All right. Put the thing on the switch. There we go. Go to the south. Um, I forgot what's in this room. Oh, two almost. Two almost. Ow. Um, uh, what's in the chest? Okay, um, if I remember right, if you have, when you get the dungeon item, you want to come back to this room. Because there's something else in this room that you might want to get. Um, yep, there's something in this room. There's going to be two switches. Is there? Yeah, there's two switches. But you can't press them. Alright, let's try to open this chest. We got the smell key. Uh, what floor am I on, anyway? Oh, one out of four, five, dang! Um, I'm going to. You know, what? I think this is good enough. Enough to end off in this for this first part of the Temple of Time. Next time on Legend of the Twilight Prince, we're going to be continuing through the Temple of Time. See you guys later.